Hello everybody, this is Brother Neuro, aka Dick Coughlin, but in this video I'll be playing the part of a guy called Mitch. I'm going to be doing a dramatic reenactment re of one of the most insane and utterly bewildering and hilarious private message exchanges that happened on Facebook um, between Mitch and uh, some poor unsuspecting young woman Whose, whose name is probably best left out of this. Um, I think she gets enough, she clearly gets enough nutters bothering her as it is. Um, I did, however, get the um, full transcript and, and screenshots of this message exchange from a Facebook page called Kitty Kinetic Sanity. I recommend you follow it. I'll leave a link to that down, uh, down below as well. Um, I hope you enjoy this. And please remember, whilst you're listening to this, that this, this guy is part of the same species that you are. Um, I hope you enjoy it, and if you do, please consider supporting me on Patreon. A uh, link to that will be below. Other than that, take it away. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> You're a feminist. Are you a virgin? No, I am not. If you are not a virgin, then what are you a feminist for? Me being a virgin has absolutely nothing to do with me believing in equal rights for women and wanting to stop the unforgivable acts committed against women across the world every day. Example? Lol. So, are you married then? Since you lost your virginity to the one you love for the rest of your life? Virginity is not a thing. Not really. It is a social construct to make people, especially women, feel bad about their sexuality and sexual experiences. It is a way of policing other people's bodies and passing judgment on how they use them. It is, at its very core, a way of controlling and subjugating women. L-O-L-O-M-F-G, do a little research on your own. Your virginity is used to grow the size of the dick of the one man you have sex with, thus the man you marry, your husband, full stop. To become the size you most want your man, the husband you marry, to have. If you wasted your virginity and it's not with the man you love and marry, then you've wasted your chance to grow the dick of a man who you love and cherish, not for his size. Also, this is how dicks get so huge. Fucking God damn it! You need to do a lot more research and stop believing in false advertising. Oh. My. God. <laughs> the virginity, as you apparently have no idea, is for one woman to specifically grow the size permanently of the male dick to the one dick so either you got ploughed by a huge dick because you're a skank or you're a virgin waiting to grow her husband so omfg you should you slash you would do a lot better in life to not believe what people tell you and actually do research oh my god 
So you wasted your chance to grow your one man who you truly love. And his name is John C. As soon as your vagina gets ploughed by something bigger than the man you want to grow, he cannot grow with your vagina. Oh my fucking God. Who raised you? Holy shit! That whole quote you sent me is a lie! So that you lose your virginity and think that it's okay! You've been falsely led to do something by someone else who has tricked Fuck! I'm not even a fucking feminist and I have more respect for women than you! Holy fucking oh my god! So now, either you can wait for a guy who already figured this out like me, or you can marry someone with a little dick and never have the chance to grow his dick to be the perfect pleasure hammer. Anyways, I just thought it would be nice for you to know what you've been so poorly and falsely misled into believing. And you actually believe that? You freaking twisted. <laughs> Go fuck any guy you want, but when it comes to getting married and all the hung nice guys are taken and you can only find the fat losers, I'll know why. Yours sincerely, Mitch. the dick size in the one man who she loves actually loves for the rest of her life to always be able to please with his size it is not to be thrown away to random men to let them fuck up o-m fucking j you freaking name and so once you have a man do the joking with a virgin and neither of you cheat on each other so either you can waste your virginity and be a whore, or you can invest your body for the rest of your life to the man. You are going to be very upset when you have sex and this doesn't work, bro. Good luck. Fucking feminist idiots. All the best. Yours sincerely, Mitch. Right. A wank, I think. Nailed it.